Uh, there's a number of different reasons why I play in the MLL. I think first, uh, just that competitive drive to want to play with and against the best players in the world is something that uh, is something not many people get to do. And uh, you know, just the, the competitiveness of it. And I love the sport of lacrosse. Lacrosse has given me a ton um, as far as um, allowing me to travel different places, different countries, go to graduate school in England. Um, so it's it's an opportunity to continue to give back and. Just again, playing at the highest level is, is something you know I always try, strive to do. Definitely. Well, it's great to be able to watch players, uh, talented players at DU, and then watching on the Outlaws. So uh, you know, a perfect example is Mark Matthews. And uh, we're excited to see him play. And you know, I was fortunate enough to be able to play in Denver as well and grow up here and kind of see the sport grow. So um, it's just cool to have a, a good college team in your town and then also a good professional team as well. Love it. Uh, that game. Sure. Uh, something, I'll get you guys ready to go. I'll take you guys through some dynamic movements. And by the time we get done moving, you, your body should feel so loose and so ready to go. But a lot of that's on you, uh, meaning you, you got to be as mechanically sound as you can possibly be while we're going through these, these warm-ups. When we get done with this dyna these dynamic movements, you should actually be sweating a little bit. All right, you guys have already been moving a little bit, so um, why don't we go down to that end line over there and just kind of make two lines front to back. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. This time when you leave, pick up the tempo just a little bit for a few steps. Just a few steps. It's a different dynamic than college. You know, we don't rely as much on the coaches to put in um, certain plays. You know, they rely a lot, a lot on the players to uh, to step up and uh, do what they've learned. Um, but thus far, the coaches have done a great job operating uh, training camp. Fundamentals, but I think the older guys will tell you, younger guys, that uh, the idea of catching the ball and turning to the outside in this league is probably a pretty good idea, right? Because you're going to get lit up. And some of these little things, like on the fast break, some of your point men, you can't step in. You, know, you got to go back to the basic fundamentals. You got to step to the ball, open the passing lanes. These defensemen are bigger, stronger, faster. You know, they're going to be in your hands. They're going to be in your hands like that. And the difference between a goal and not scoring a goal in this league is, you know, is that half a second. Okay, and uh, I could scream and yell at you about it because you all know better than that, right? So just think about doing the little things right. That's what's, what's going to separate us, and that's what's going to separate you guys from each other, what you're trying to do here. All right, grab some water quick. Good job. All right, boys. First drill. Uh, well, the first goal was the play, obviously. You want to get into that top 19 uh, roster spots, which is hard to get to. There's all Americans all over the field, you know, so you got to work, put in the time. Um, the other thing is winning games and winning a championship. Uh, Denver 
hasn't won a championship yet. They've been in the playoffs, so we're just trying to get to that next level. And uh, you know, let the game come to you a little bit. You know, your opportunities will be there. Create your opportunities, find the space. And again, I think this is a big one. Play fast, but don't hurry. Okay? trying to do offensively it's you got a little bit of time it's pick it up move it move it shoot it okay and d get out there and put some pressure on him slap him up a little bit make him work for the ground balls okay so d everybody's back on the uh, on the end line there that's all you got to do good on your right that's it stay with it move it move it nice play good job man look up look up finish oh. today is, that, is the coaching staff is very focused and they know what they know what they want to do and what they expect from us and uh, I think a lot of times in the pro league there's kind of like a, a roll the ball out and let's play kind of mentality whereas our coaches know what we want to do and, and, and want to execute that and that's kind of refreshing I think um, you know kind of ease that transition I guess from college you know to, to the pro game and um, kind of be a little bit more disciplined about what we're going to get done uh, on the field. I really believe that if we talk about specific goals, I think the whole organization has one specific goal, and that's it. It's very, very simple. To win the MML Championship, that's our goal. 